RPB is the respiratory protection brand. Our mission is creating the world's best industrial respirators that advance your safety and increase your productivity, ultimately protecting you for life's best moments. We speak about the life of steel. So from when it's a raw piece of steel until it goes through to becoming a finished product, we can protect the operators that work on that piece of steel right through the whole process. So from welding, grinding, blasting, painting, we have the full respiratory range to protect those operators right through to that piece of steel becomes a finished product. We've put a lot of time and effort into the design of our products to protect everyone for life's best moments and assure that they get home safely to their family and friends at the end of each day. It is something that we actually talk about every single day. I can't think of a day here at RPB where we haven't talked about protecting you for life's best moments. It is absolutely at the core of, of what we do. It's worldwide. In the U.S. we see that again and again. We, we talked about, you know, the forgotten industrial soldiers, you know, people who, who this country has been built on in terms of going to work every day, these men and women working really hard to, to bring home, you know, the, the money to put food on the table. It's about as basic as that. So if we go a few generations back, you're dealing with an area, you know, blasting or sandblasting as they refer to it in those days. That was a, a tough job, still a tough job today. But uh, they took a job that was uh, really tough and tough to do and decided, well, hold it. Why can't we change how things are done? Why can't we make people more comfortable? Why can't we apply some uh, advanced thinking here? And, you know, that's what's happened. RPB started in the late 70s. It was actually started by my grandfather. And the reason he started the, the company was he owned an abrasive blasting company that did abrasive blasting in Christchurch, New Zealand. And they couldn't get comfortable respirators for their, for their workers. So he started making his own. He just made them in his garage and used them for his own guys. What he did was he put a padding system in it, a bit like a motorcycle helmet. And still today, people call our abrasive blasting respirator the motorcycle fit respirator. And he did that to make his guys more comfortable and make them more productive. So that was in the 70s, and that philosophy still stands for us today. Products made in the US have always been recognised worldwide as good quality products. And it's important to, to us to keep employment here in the country as well. There was a big transition for us because we used to manufacture everything in New Zealand and it was a big transition to move everything here, but we understood that the market we were serving was a manufacturing market and made in the USA was becoming more and more important. And most of our products go into the manufacturing sector or otherwise the service and repair sector. Those that are, are building our ships, building our trains, building our planes, you know, it means a lot to better provide them an American made product. We understand a lot of these respirators in the past, particularly in the welding grinding industry, the products have been heavy. They've been uncomfortable, so that's why people don't want to wear them. And that's why we've done all we can in product development to lighten them up, make them more ergonomic, make them more comfortable so they can be worn for a full working day. What we say is a, is a comfortable operator is a safe operator. And a safe operator gets home at night. As I said earlier, our mission about advancing safety and increasing productivity so during the development process of our products, there are two questions that get asked. How's this going to advance someone's safety? How's this going to increase their productivity? How's it going to protect them for life's best moments? And I think that our team is just so passionate about protecting people. That's what makes our culture so special. And it goes through to what we do as a company for charities as well. We work with a lot of charities every year, you know, just looking out for those people that are in need and um, doing our part to, to help them. So giving back is a very important part of our culture and I think that does tie back into life's best moments. We are making a, a real product that um, is saving lives on a daily basis. Uh, that's pretty profound. I go back to protecting you for life's best moments. Um, I talked to the folks in the factory a week or two back and I said, you know, at this very, on this very day, we've got product in Europe, we have product you know, in Australia at, at shows, we're selling product throughout the United States, 
you've made that all here in Michigan, you should be pretty proud because you're actually bringing people home safe to their families. Their businesses have become um, better because they're more protected and more productive and everybody wins. So I can put a smile on your face. It's a real product doing really good things for people.